Welcome to my female founder series where I pick a different female founder every week and share with you their story for how they got to where they are today. Today we are talking about Whitney Hurd who is the founder of Bumble. Bumble IPO'd a couple of weeks ago, making Whitney one of the youngest self-made billionaires in the entire world. Now, Whitney breaks the mold of a tech entrepreneur because she does not have a degree in STEM and she didn't raise millions in venture capital just to build Bumble. She did study international business and previously founded two companies. One was a not-for-profit called The Help Us Project and the other was a clothing line called Tender Heart. So it seems like she's always had some kind of entrepreneurial spirit. At 22, Whitney joined a startup incubator called Hatch Labs. I don't think it exists anymore. During the incubator, she got involved with Cardify, but I think they disbanded and didn't get very far. Go to my page for part two.